Okay, now I'm just going to show you how to quickly alter some of the scenes that are already in there, mostly the solid color, in case you need to match a different color. And the way you're going to do this is you want to go to this icon up here on the top left underneath File. This is your builder mode. You want to be in the builder mode. Um, this is usually what it looks like when you first click on it. Now, obviously, you want my file loaded in there. You go to Selections. And then down here, you have your, your scenes, all the scenes that we made. Um, if we pick this warm white scene, just make sure it's highlighted. You'll notice here that you're gonna you're gonna click on the basic block, and um, this takes up this uh, priorities or properties and um, features. So you want to be in the features mode. You want to scroll all the way down so you'll see this plus for the color sign. Sometimes when you open it, there might be these these drop downs are open. You just want to close them, and when you hit this, you're then gonna get pick. Uh, what's gonna pop up is the color picker. And so you basically can pick any color you want. You can change the warmth, the temperature of any of them. You hit OK, and then that scene now has the changes in it. And then what you're going to do to bump that onto your card is you go to where we were before, which is the um, standalone mode. You're going to take that scene, click this arrow here. That moves it over into the side over here. And it's basically telling you that this uh, was already added to the device. It cannot be written twice. So another way you can do it without um, having that overwrite is if you're back in your builder mode and you want to you, you want to right click on this and hit duplicate. Right. And then that's going to put a duplicate copy on the same scene. So you click this. So let's just change the name of this by double clicking on it. And we could just sit warm white three, warm white solid three, just to distinguish between the two ones. Yep, and now you're gonna hit basic, your basic block, and this comes up to your um, your uh, color picker here. You're gonna hit your color. You can change it to, let's just change it to red, just for an example, hit okay. And now when you go to your standalone mode and you scroll all the way down to this warm white, you're going to click this arrow. It's going to bump it over here. And you can see it's already at the bottom. And then you're gonna plug in your um, your controller and then you want to go through and hit the right button and that will bump it bump that new change into the controller you can also delete these if you needed them you can you know basically clean this up but i've just been adding new things to it just so that you have everything that we made you can always revert back all right that's basically how to change a quick color and get it into the controller